that specific phenomenological experience of baseball is like a, it's like a microcosm of, of life. EFIS is a, an ode to amateur baseball, a group of enthusiasts. The film takes the form of a single baseball game played on a suburban field. The last time this field will be used before it's bulldozed. Um, and it charts the, the progress of uh, one, an autumn day turning into night and a group of men kind of coming to terms with the end of an era together. The further you dive into specificity, the, the, the closer you get to universality. I wanted to make a movie that really captured the minutia of the game, but in such a way that it reveals kind of the passion and determination. This could be a film about any enthusiast community that, that, that gathers outside of the daily grind, just purely for camaraderie's sake. There's no profit motive. So I think this is a film about reckoning with our aging and trying to kind of maintain some community as we, especially in America, as, as we kind of f further isolate from one another, and especially as our environments continue to sort of gentrify and, and, and change around us. I really thought of this as a, a landscape film at first. My initial intention was almost to shoot it in an almost more documentary. I don't naturally think in the three-act structure. Um, I think more in terms of atmosphere and mood and location, obviously, as a cinematographer. Without having to kind of chart the progression of one single person, it was more about the, 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 the structure of the game itself and the, and the day became the narrative. I wanted it to be about an era before the technology that now dictates our lives, right? I wanted this to be about men who have to relate to one another without any, without any seeming distractions. But I really wanted this to be about this place as a refuge from all of the noise outside the field. Creating a sort of timeless feeling would facilitate that idea. They all have their own enthusiasms regarding what they own and, and, and prize and privilege. That's really important as well, so that the, this feeling of pre-technological um, passion. 